Welcome back guys. So today's video is going to be my coffee bar station or kind of my morning station. This is the first place that I head to every single morning when I wake up. And all of the coffee bars that I have ever seen have been more country or farmhouse. And while that style is really cute, it's just not my personal style. So I wanted to share with you guys what I've been doing that's a little bit more modern, but still functions as my coffee bar. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's go ahead and jump into it. So on top I have my Keurig because I have to make my coffee somehow. And then on one side I have my orchid. I just showed this in my last video. I think it's so pretty. And then on the other side I always keep treats in here, whether it's muffins or donuts, especially on Mondays and Wednesdays. On Mondays I have my great grandparents over. And then on Wednesdays Tim's off, so I like to have his favorite like breakfast treat in there. So I just like to keep everything very simple, minimalistic, and the necessities. So now let's go ahead and move into the cabinet doors, starting with cabinet door number one. So this is cabinet door number one. On the very top shelf, I have these drawers from the container store. I love them, they're stackable. I'm sure you guys have seen them throughout YouTube. A lot of people use them for makeup, which I think I'm gonna do in the very near future because they are so good. But in this one, I just have my white mugs. I like to use these for guests when they come over. They're all white, they're simple, they're clean, they're easy to replace if something were to happen to them. I believe I got these at Target for like $1.99, $2.99, so very inexpensive. And I just like how classic they are. Moving down to shelf number two on this shelf I have two Ikea containers and I love this collection all of the containers that you see right now are actually from the same collection they're just different sizes but um, on this shelf I have some extra silverware plastic you never know when you're gonna need it especially if you're hosting barbecues things like that um, and then in the next container I have all of my like decorative paper napkins that are like seasonal or just have really cute sayings on them. So that is everything that I keep on this shelf. And then for the bottom shelf, I have the two little containers on top of the bigger container. And those two are actually from Home Goods, and I believe those are for sugar and flour. But I just flip them around and I put my own labels with my label maker on there. And I use them for Annabelle's treats and then her little greenies. And then I just have those sitting on top of the container where I keep her leash. I take her to go potty first thing in the morning, so I like everything together like with my coffee station because I can start my coffee take her to go potty come back in grab her treats and then she's good to go I'm good to go and so it works out perfect but then right next to that I have the massive IKEA container where I keep all of my extra candles I'm really picky about my candles but I do have some extras in here especially if I'm gonna be hosting and I want to obviously light some candles for some ambiance to the house so I just keep my extra ones in here they fit perfectly and then I have my things like that in there too. So this cabinet is pretty much for like entertaining and then of course Annabelle towards the bottom. Um, so let's go ahead and jump into cabinet number two which is a little bit more like every day, day to day. So starting on the top shelf, this is where I keep our supplements. I moved it here about like three months ago and it's worked out so well because let's be honest, I forget to take my supplements like every day. So putting them here is a really great reminder when I take my coffee, when I take my coffee, when I have my coffee, um, to take them before I actually drink my coffee because I reach in here to get my coffee. So I just have one labeled for me and then I also have one labeled for Tim so it just keeps everything really organized. And then right next to that I have a clear container. I got this one at Home Goods as well. And this one is where I just keep my reusable K cup in case I just want regular coffee. Um, and then I also have my mushroom coffee in there. And then I also have some paper straws, which I actually use to stir my cream in my coffee, which I will show you guys here in just a minute, the creamer that I use. It's so delicious, literally, that's the name of it. But I just keep um, the loose packets of the coffee on the side. So the ones that I can't fit in the side, I just put in the back of the reusable section, if that makes sense. Now moving down to the second shelf, which is my favorite little shelf. I just love this little tea box so much. I love that it has a clear top on it because I can see all of the tea that's inside of it Which makes it really convenient when you're going to look for a specific tea that you want Or if you have people over and they need to pick what tea they want It's really easy just to pass it around and them to pick and I also want to let you guys know the labels that I have on all the bigger items like the Ikea containers and also the tea box are actually just a 
stickers from Walmart and they're just individual so I picked them off and then I put them together to make the words and I just thought it was a fun little spin on just like a traditional label from a label maker. And then the bottom shelf in this cabinet has another container from the container store, one of the drawers, the pull out ones, and I just keep our like random fun mugs in there. So I like have some holiday mugs, my Kate Spade, Tim has a couple in there and I just store those there. And then on top of that I just have some white espresso mugs and I just use these in case I need extras to be really honest. And then on the side of that is where I have all the K-cups. You can never have too many so I like to store those there. Also I like that this one spins because you can just put it on the counter and then spin it around. Um, so it's perfect if you're gonna have guests over. So anyways that is it for my little morning station coffee bar, coffee station, whatever you want to call it. It just works out really perfect for us and I just wanted to show you guys my spin on just kind of like a modern like minimalistic I guess coffee station if you will um, so I hope you guys enjoyed it and um, I love this cabinet too I'll link it down below I forgot to mention that it is from Ikea it's super affordable and I just think it's really cute so anyways thank you guys so much for watching if you're not subscribed be sure to subscribe before you leave and I will see you guys next time bye